What's up? Kermit, I have a question. Have you ever heard of this program called Swiftu? Um, no. And I don't know what that is. Well, my froggy friend, Swiftu is actually today's sponsor for this video. Ooh, tell me more. Will do, Kermit. Swiftu is a powerful PDF editor that makes it easier to make changes on the PDF you want to change. You can add or delete text, change the font size and or color, and insert any links or images to your PDF. But why should I choose it? Well, Swiftu PDF design and very useful editing tools help make the changing process so much simpler and quicker. Plus, for anyone who's pretty tight on computer storage, this software only takes up 10 megabytes disk space, which also makes it quicker to download when installing it on your computer. Oh, speaking of quick, PDFs do open up quickly, so no more waiting for 5 minutes for your PDF to open in a PDF program. Worried about the data or information from your PDF getting leaked? No problem! Swiftu has a 2 level password protection differentiated permissions, and legally binding electronic signature. So that way, you can protect your PDF securely. So register today and install Swiftu. When you do register, you'll be given a 30-day trial. Now I can edit my PDFs easier thanks to Swiftu. The link to their site is down below in the description if you want to give Swiftu a try. Thanks for having me sponsor this amazing product, Swiftu. Now let's get back to Kermit and the truths and dares he's going to do. Wow. Swift dude sounds pretty cool. I'll check it out sometime. Awesome to know. Anyways, are you ready for episode 2 of Kermit Croaks the Truths and Dares? Yeah! Let's do some more! <laughs> also, uh, before we begin, do we have more truths this time? No, we don't. Okay, I quit. I was just kidding. Don't! EVER DO THAT AGAIN! So, we're starting the truth first. Just like we did last time. Okay, let's get started with the truths! Psycube asks, Kermit, what is your most bizarre nickname? My most bizarre nickname? Hmm, that's a good question. Hmm, I think my most bizarre name would be... Frog Legs. Wait, Frog Legs? Who calls you Frog Legs? Um, some kids up on the street. I'm concerned about where you live, Kermit. Anyways, moving on to the next one. Starlink07 asks, Is hamburgers and fries your favorite meal? Eh, they're not really my favorite. I have better favorites. And what is your favorite? I like hot dogs. Hot dogs, you say? Yeah. Why do you like hot dogs? I don't know, they just taste pretty good. Especially if there's a fly on it. Kermit, why if there's a fly on it? Well, you know, I'm a frog. Oh, true. Frogs do like flies. Yeah, and the best flies to get out of hot dogs taste even better. Okay, moving on with the next question. Jackson the Inkling Kid asks, How long have you been with Angeltoon for? Eh, been with her since around 2018. I was a real goofball back then. Kermit, don't act like you never were a goofball. What did I just say? I said I've always... Um... I'm a less for words. Well, to this day, you're still a goofball. Aww. Well, in a good way. Yay! Because people like when I'm dumb! For some reason. Alright, moving on with the next question. Multiple asks, How did you get out of jail from those dares? Well, um... This is a hard explanation. Um, Kermit, I had to use up my money just to bail you out. Do you not realize how much I had to waste? Um... Well, that's one thing. I didn't think it was by escaping. There's no police over there, right? Um, no. Okay, good. Moving on. Stupid Matthew Bros asks, Do you eat frog legs? Why would I eat frog legs? That's... That's late from another frog! That would be cannibalism! I do not eat frog legs. I don't eat stuff from another frog. I'm a frog! That would be wrong and disgusting. Mark Rojas 2022 asks, what is your favorite The Amazing World of Gumball character? Um, I don't watch The Amazing World of Gumball, but I heard about the cartoon. Now, if I have to pick my favorite... But, Kermit, you say you don't watch a show. How can you have a favorite when you've never watched it? Okay, yeah, good question. I don't have a favorite at all. Sorry. UV asks, Hey, Kermit, what's your biggest pet peeve? 
Well, you should already know what my biggest pet peeve is. Elmo annoying the heck out of me every time. Mostly by him stalking me. Well, that's understandable. Now don't blame me for having that pet peeve. Fluff Petter asks, Kermit, what do you think about in your spare time? Um, that's a good question. What do I think about during my spare time? Um, I think about food, more food, taking a nap, eating flies, robbing a big, I, I, I mean, um, uh, um, uh, um, going to the park. Kermit, you don't go to the park. I gotta go. Kermit, get back here. Oh my god, we gotta get him back. All right, Kermit, that was all of the truce. Okay, well, that was a better amount than last episode. All right, Kermit, are you ready for the dares? Bring them in! Your first dare is by Connor Jackson, which is to punch Tankman in the face, which he will get mad and send out his troops to come after you, and also the police as well. Hmm. This city doesn't even look that bad. Hmm. Okay, fine. As long as nobody destroys my mask in any way, especially punching it, I should be just fine standing here. Oh, hey, Tick Man. It's so good to see you. Scram, Frog. I'm trying to mind my own business here. Oh, no problem. I just want to give you a gift. I think you'll like this gift. And what kind of gift would that be? Just a little... Punch on the mask. Ha 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 ha. Okay, you know what? That's it! Where are my troops? Get Kermit! Now! You destroyed my mask! And get the police too while you're at it! Kermit, get back over here! Come on, man! Why are you have to do this? Well, I bought this mushroom from Craigslist. I'm hoping it tastes pretty good. Though that again, it is pink. I don't know if I like the color pink, but you know what? It'll probably taste good. Let me give it a try. No, no, no. Hmm. Looks like nothing happened. This feels like a ripoff. Wow! You're so kawaii. Ah! What the heck is that? Get out of here! Stupid. Oh god. Ah! We gotta go, gotta go, gotta go! Come on, guys, use this way. What is that? What is this abomination? Uh, sir, what is that? Let's not question it. Let's go. Let's go find Kermit. Come on, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Are you serious? <laughs> Step right there. All right, Kermit, we finally found you. You're going to have to come with us. You're under arrest for not only abusing a person, which was take men, by the way, but also for... I think we saw that happen, um... You know what? Never mind that part. All I know is that you broke the guy's mask. That probably was expensive. Now you're gonna have to come with us. You're under arrest. You're surrounded, so you have nowhere else to go but to come with us. So let's go. Did... Did you guys just kill our forces? Uh, we didn't mean to. Now you're also under arrest! Come on, man! We lost our men and women! Because we also have females in our forces, but still! Come on! Your next dare is by Psychoop, which is to Pirate Mario Party DS. What the heck? It's probably my package. Oh! It is! It's the pirated Mario Party DS that I bought off the dark web! Well, I was lucky to get this for free, so that's good. Okay. Let's play this mini game. This is gonna be so much fun. Wait, what the? What? How did he detect it? What? Piracy is no party? Um. That's... Oh no. I'm... I'm scared. FBI, open up! 
<laughs> Your next error is by Jackson the Inkling Kid, which is to screw with Mikey the 14th Doctor and Elmo. Okay, Elmo, I brought some jelly babies, so maybe we can share it if that's fine with you. Well, you sound pretty good. Alright, sure, Elmo will have some. Just make sure that Kermit doesn't buy a note because the last time he stole my jelly babies and I had to buy more and get some stuff from the TARDIS. Uh, on, uh, oh, hey, Kermit. Ooh, is that some jelly babies? Hmm. It would be a shame if I, you know, stole it. You got it, sir. Seven is Kermit. Um. No. Oh. <gasps> Dang it, Kermit! Get back over here with my jelly babies! Bro, this is the only last time that I'm dealing with this. Man, I can't have nice things. Your next stare is by multi roll which is to pilot an airplane. Hello, this is your captain speaking. I am Kermit the Frog, and I am now a pilot of this airplane. And I'm new to this, so uh, it's really likely I'm gonna screw the plane over. Hey, 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 let's not scare the passengers like that. Well, I'm just being honest. I mean, what does this plane even do? No, oh, don't press that! <laughs> Your next stare is by Super Matthew Brothers, which is to play a game I call Extreme Leapfrog with Angela. Basically, you have to play the game on very narrow platforms. Try to survive. Well, here we are, Angela. We're going to be doing Extreme Leapfrog. And since you Inklings can die from water, um, if you fall, you basically die, so... Nah, I think you'll be just fine. Um... Uh, Let's get started, shall we? Okay, Angela, your turn. Your next stare is by Yuvi, which is a steel donuts in the Simpsons house and Homer Simpson comes to Kermit and beats him up. Ooh, this must be the Simpson house. Okay, now to get those donuts. Wow, they're dumb enough to even leave the door unlocked. What fools. Okay, where are those donuts? I gotta steal them by eating them. Okay, if I was a donut, where would I be? <gasps> Okay, that'd be quite a bit I don't know if anybody's home. I don't know if anyone's home. But I'm gonna assume they're not, and I'm gonna eat the donuts. Woohoo! I'm a college man! I am too smart! I am too smart! I am- <laughs> nom, nom, nom. Nom. Oh no. Uh, hey, Homer, I was uh, going to save you, donut. Oh. Um, I might have. Uh, Possibly stole your toys by eating them. <laughs> Funny story, uh. You little. Ah! Meh. The final dare is by Axel Gallus, which is to literally just do a prank on Angel Tune because Chucky told him to. Okay. I'm gonna make this prank simple. All I'm gonna do is just litter this soda can, like this. No one saw that. And then when Angel Toon comes over there, I'm going to say that she did it. And if she dies it, uh, we're gonna call her sus. This is gonna be like an Among Us episode. Okay. Oh crap, she's coming! Okay, what is this? Come on, why are you people still litter? Uh, okay. Well, I might as well pick it up. Oh my god, Angel Tune Litter! Dude, why would you litter the soda can? What? Dude, you know I don't litter. Did, did you do this? But how do you know it was me? It could have been you, because you're close to it. You were the first to be to that soda can. So, therefore, you littered. I did not litter the soda can, Kermit. Mm, that's pretty sus of you, Angel Tune. What do you think this is, Among Us? Well, this is now an Among Us episode, so uh, welcome to Among Us and uh, Angel Tune and Sus, uh, I'm gonna vote her out. <sighs> Kermit, just tell me the truth. Did you actually litter it? And if you did, why are you trying to frame me for it? 
Well, congratulations! You got it all figured out! I actually pranked you! You pranked me by trying to frame me? What is wrong with you, Kermit? Don't you realize of how much trouble I could have got into along with you? Maybe, but uh, there are no cops, so uh, we're fine. <sighs> Why would you do this? Okay, listen, alright? I was there to do this, and um, let's just say uh, Chucky wanted Axel to dare that to be, so uh, I don't want to do the prank because I thought it'd be funny. Okay, first off, that was not funny, and second, Chucky did this? He's the cause of this? Yes, I admit it! He caused this! Dang it! Chucky, where are you at? Get over here, you stupid hand puppet! <laughs> uh, there you are, Chucky! Get over here! Get over here! Uh, well, at least I didn't get arrested this time. Are you serious? You littered this soda can? Um... I was gonna pick it up! Not this again. Not this again! Alright, you know what? Come with me, go to arrest! Oh, come on, for littering? Yes, that's illegal! You can't be littering! You do realize they're supposed to be going in the garbage can! What is wrong with you? Get over here, litter bug. Aw, oh, man. Alright, Kermit, that was all the truth in there. So how do you feel? Well, I'll be honest, it was a much better experience than recent episodes. At least we got more truth this time. Yeah. Well, hopefully you'll be prepared for episode 3. Oh, I sure will! For more truths and dares. Oh, speaking of dares, at least I still had those jelly babies from the other dare. Um... <laughs> You'll never get your jelly babies back! I will get them! Also, one thing for sure. You'll never take anything away, you frog sandwich!